Welcome to the wonderful world of chemistry. Today, with the help of the alchemy set by Mel Chemistry, we will obtain an essence from a fruit juice. Perform this experiment on a plastic tray to contain any possible spills. Don't forget to put on protective goggles before doing the experiment. For the distillation experiment, you will need three candles, a silicon tube, a test tube with a stopper, a metallic cylinder, a beaker filled with cool water, fruit juice, the flask, the funnel, the rubber stopper with one hole, the solid fuel stove, and the flame diffuser. In addition, you will also need matches or a lighter. Using the funnel, pour 40 milliliters of juice into the flask. Now insert approximately half a centimeter of the metallic cylinder into the rubber stopper and put the silicon tube onto the other end of the cylinder. Carefully close the flask with the stopper. Prepare the solid fuel stove. Put three candles into the stove, light them and cover the stove with the flame diffuser. Now put the test tube into the beaker with the water. Put the flask onto the flame diffuser and place the loose end of the silicon tube into the test tube. Fruit juices contain fragrant substances as well as water. When a fruit juice is heated, these fragrant substances evaporate more quickly than water, with the result that they separate from the fruit juice and flow through the silicon tube into the test tube. The water in the beaker which the test tube is placed in cools down the vaporized fragrant substances along with the water vapor back to a liquid state. As a result, the essence collects at the bottom of the test tube. Chemists call this process distillation. Wait until a little essence has collected at the bottom of the test tube. Despite being totally transparent, this liquid will have a strong fruit smell. You can preserve the essence by sealing the test tube with a stopper. Learn more about this experiment on our Mel Science website.